Hi, I'm Roman Kurogi. Let me show you my dad. One thing that a lot of people have been asking about is the mosquito net. So first of all, you take off this metal piece here, and the mosquito net just slides out. The next feature we have outside is the outdoor shower. The outdoor shower is also pretty awesome in the summertime because you can just open up here and we have shower table here. It just pops in. Ah! After you shower, you can just reach in here for a towel or a poncho, whatever you need. Close it up. Good to go. Let's see the inside. This is our kitchen area. We have a mic microwave here, a uh, sound system control up here, some storage here. Uh, this is a table anchor that I'll show you later. Here's our sink. Sink cover pops out, sink folds up, sink folds down, it goes away. We have more counter space here. Of course, we've got the max fan up here. It's perfect when you open these windows, all the air circulates out. Folding table here and stove range here. Of course, we have freezer and fridge here. Uh, these both stay running 24 seven. So we don't have to worry about things getting warm or thawing out. This is our bed area. We have overhead storage on both sides. And here is the control panel. Everything is controlled from here. We've got the lights, the outdoor lights. This is the fridge. We've got inverter here, max fan here, uh, water pump here, and this is for the TV and radio. This is one of my favorite features. A lot of people have asked about too, but honestly, this is why we went with this company and why we bought this fan as opposed to other companies, it's this shower right here. So as you can see, it's built in like a closet, but when you open it up, these doors fold out like so. There's our toilet there, shower there. Now you might be thinking that's pretty small, but the beauty of this shower is it folds out like so, and you have somewhat of a full shower. Then shower curtain slides out to accommodate you and you have pretty much a full apartment size shower almost inside the van. Pretty neat. These four holes are vents for the heating system. So in the winter time you can turn on the floor heating and uh, it runs on a separate diesel engine. So we can have full uh, winter heating anytime. Here are the controls inside. So here we have the uh, solar panel. You can see it's 92%. You can see the voltage going in. Uh, when it's blinking on and off, that means it's charging. We have outlet here, power outlet here. This is to control the hot water heater. So to turn the hot water heater on, give it clicks until you see the red light up. It takes a couple of minutes, but after that you can have a hot shower, wash some dishes, whatever you need. All right, once you peel back all the layers, you can see all the components here. Here is our solar charger, our giant Korean inverter. Uh, here is AC to DC digital charger. And this is from the drive power, so we can charge the battery while driving. Underneath all of this is a 540 ampere battery, and on top is a 300 watt solar panel. So with all of this uh, put together, we never have any problems. Uh, most of the time we're driving, so it charges a little bit, and if not, even when it's not so sunny outside, we still get a bit of a charge. So we've never run flat, we've never even come close to it.
All right, when you peel back the second layer over here, uh, you can see right now we're using it for storage, but in the summertime, this is where the compressor condenser goes for the aircon system. So the unit actually fits right up here and you can strap it in. Uh, it's about this big, so it takes up some space. So when we're not using it, we like to pull it out. Uh, also, you can see here the water flow system, cold and hot water. And right here, this tube goes to the water tank from the outside. Water tank sits right below us as well. Now we're to the back. This is where I spend most of my time. We have this mosquito net here, keep the bugs out. And this is where most of our storage is. So if we pop this down, this works as a table. You can sit on it. We also have plenty of storage down here. As you can see, this is where I keep my smoker, some chairs, random storage. So when you're on the go or you're boondocking, you need to fill up with water. We usually carry a few of these. They're great because they're collapsible. And a 12 volt water pump. One thing we don't have is a black water tank. As you can see, our toilet is inside. We empty that often and we don't usually do number two. So our black water tank is non-existent. If you need to go number two, let's find a bathroom. Since we opted for all the features in the kitchen, there's only two seats in this van, but that doesn't mean there's not much room. So these seats are both uh, able to swivel, they're on a pivot. So just pull it forward and find the latch. And it spins around like that. As promised, I'll show you the optional table here. So this thing removes pretty easily. You can store it in the back or wherever you want. And you can use it as computer table, dining room table, whatever you want. All right, last but not least, we have the TV system. TV folds down like this. Uh, this is a smart TV, but we installed uh, Amazon Fire Stick, rather. So all you do is link that to your Wi-Fi through your hotspot or your cell phone, which what we do. And your Fire TV can power up, you can watch whatever you want, Netflix, live TV, everything. In addition to the TV, we also have the stereo system. So the stereo system is Bluetooth and it hooks up to uh, two 50 watt car stereo speakers that are in the back. If you want to watch a movie or you just want to chill out, this bed also becomes a couch. So, we don't use this often, but it's there if you like. One feature I didn't mention is the retractable awning here. So we have this awning, it folds out quite easily. However, one of the legs, plastic parts, snapped off. So I'm unable to show it to you right now. But in the future, this will be able to pull out, block the sun, block the rain, everything like that. Thanks for taking the time to look at our Jurassic Pugs van. And if you have any questions, just leave it in the comments. I'd be happy to answer them. And that's it, yeah. That's our van. Thanks for taking the time. If you want to watch a movie or you just want to chill, this bed also. <laughs> Cut. <laughs>